Welcome back to Steph's Hairstyles for Girls. I'm going to show you how to put in these heatless curlers and I'll show you the results on both short hair and long hair. I put in the curlers and showed the re see the results here for the long hair a few months ago before I cut my daughter's hair. We will go ahead and get started. We're going to just put the long blue thing just push it all the way through make it go so you see the the top there and then you're gonna kind of like a needle put the hair in it and then just bring the pull the hair out and I did not need these super big ones with her shorter hair here but I just used them specifically for the top pieces I used the green and the yellow ones or shorter ones I probably could have used them for all of her hair not completely sure but when her hair was super long I definitely used the pink and the orange curlers you want to make sure all of her hair is wet this is a really simple hairdo to to fix I like doing it the night before when I know that I'm not gonna have very much time the next day they're really easy to take apart or take out the next day and then just do something simple and have those gorgeous curls the next morning you want to make sure the hair is nice and wet that's what's gonna get give you the curls so when it dries they just curl up you can see they have different sizes I will link what are similar on Amazon the ones I have I believe I got off of Groupon a while ago you can just see you just put it around the hair and then pull that little tube through and then pull down the hair and then it just curls right up then I will just fast forward the rest of it All right, so we are going to go ahead and take these out today. She's very excited to see yes. the curls today. Yes. And I'll just... It seems see. like there are no, no okay. curls. Okay, so what we want to do... Okay. What we want to do is you want to make sure that you, you um, push these out so it doesn't hurt her quite as, as bad. So you just want to... So it's not so tight right here. So push them and then it's easier. Pull them out. And then there. Wow. Look how curly that is. I really want to see all the curls right now. All the curls. I want to see all the curls right now. Okay. And again, I'm going to pinch them the opposite way so that it doesn't just pull on her hair so much. I'm going to stretch it out and it just comes out very easily. 
and then I'm going to, I'm just going to do it like that. I'm going to pinch it the opposite way of what it naturally does, kind of make it straight and pull it out. And then, hang on sweetie, hang on sweetie. And then I'm just going to put it back together. And then I'll, leave it, I'll go back. So I'm just going to go around her whole head and, and do that and then show you the final product. is taking it out of the short hair and again make sure you are pinching those opposite of what it naturally is straightening it and then it just slides right on off really easy but if you don't pinch it it just pulls on their hair a little bit more once you pinch that end there it can slide off so much easier and it just doesn't pull at their hair quite as much as it could if you didn't pinch at it. I particularly love the longer hair more and unfortunately I chopped her hair a little bit too much more than I wanted to and it will grow back but this is the result of a shorter hairstyle with these again just showing you the pinch the opposite way that they naturally are to pull them out and I will speed up the rest of the process so you can see the end result she wanted to wear this headband that came with her pants and outfit so that's what we did for today's hairstyle so we did the the curlers and I probably pulled them apart a little bit too much, more than I wanted to. But then I just put up the headband.